Panther, Lion, 620, 500, 620, what in the world? A new green Steiger from Ertl? Let's talk tractors, y'all. Well, look at what just showed up on my model farm. If it isn't the Case IH Steiger 620 HD 60th Anniversary Edition. Oh, yeah. This thing is cool. So this is the 2017 Farm Show Edition. I guess we're getting those super early, or maybe it's for Louisville, which I guess is uh, just coming right up for all you guys that get there, that are lucky enough to go to that. Anyway, so this is basically a standard Ertl 620. You know, Case IH, Red Tractor. I probably got one of those somewhere here. <clears throat> Oh, well, okay, so I have a 500. Here's a little secret. It's the same tractor. But the rear end's a little bit different. Uh, the front end's pretty much identical. Um, like I said, rear end's different. Obviously, the cab gets painted a little different. And this one has different wheels and tires. Kind of wish this had these on there. But that's okay, because I got some tires from Mini Toy Truck and Tractor this weekend, and I'm going to print myself some fancy rims, and we are going to have our own wheels and tires for the Steiger 620 60th Anniversary Edition. So, just a quick going over here. Like I said, there's nothing completely out of the ordinary here. Nothing real fancy about this, except for the paint scheme. But, you know, you get your standard front weights. Like I said, these wheels are weak. They're just, they're just weak. But, uh, you know, big old honking muffler here. Um, intake on this side. So one downside of this, while, while I'm thinking about it, I'm going to try to hold this steady. Yeah, my cab wiggles. Why does my cab wiggle? I think there's a screw up under here, if I remember correctly. Not a screw up, but a screw up under there. And... Of course, you have to split the casting and all that. Um, so whatever. But there's the uh, the date tag and all that on there, and uh, all that fun stuff. So this is made in 2016, obviously, and we just got them now. <clears throat> anyway, I'm being nitpicky about the cab because let's be honest, it's gonna sit on my shelf forever. <laughs> well, it may go on a display. Eh, we'll see. Anyway, the paint job is killer. It's of, you know, so I've got back here, I probably probably should have grabbed that for you, but you can see in the background there is the anniversary quad track, and that's the anniversary of the quad track. So this is the Steiger anniversary, so it's a little different, but it's a similar paint scheme. But this one with Steiger green just looks amazing. And I should have bought more of these, if I'm honest. I should have... I only bought two. I bought one to keep in the box and one to customize. I should have just bought a fleet of them. Put like a million different tires, combinations on them, so on and so forth. But I didn't. Um, you get some step grip over here. It's just some tampo, so there's not really any texture to it. Um, you, you know, you get your under your... You get your ladder here. This is all... That's plastic. I'm a little surprised at that. Um, you got your ladder here. So that would be plastic as well. So I'm trying to decide if I could grind that off and make it better detail. We'll see. Um... Nice weights back here. PTO shaft. I don't know if that's going to show up too well. There we go. If I get the light just right, it will. My left arm is blocking the light from the right side. Yeah. <clears throat> anyway, and your standard flat tab hitch. So I need to look on the real one because these lights seem goofy to me. We get one square and one round. Is that is it that way on the real one? I, I don't know. Hmm. I'm going to have to do some checking. Another thing that's odd, but it's just it's just the way the paint is. This side is just a little glossier black than this side. This side's more of the matte, uh, like eh, satin black. I don't know if I'm going to call it matte. Satin would probably be the better word for it. So it makes them look uneven, but they're not. It's actually pretty well put together there. There's there's you know there's a seam, but there's nothing uneven about them. And of course you get your big old uh, tanks here, painted Steiger green as well. So anyway. I hope you liked that quick little video on 
the 60th anniversary 620 Steiger case IH whatever you want to call it from Ertl pretty sweet tractor paid 20 bucks for it so I suspect you'll be able to get these for 20 bucks probably most of this year because if it's going to be a farm show tractor like I said this maybe is a Louisville thing it's probably a farm progress show thing so they're going to be available for a while and I assume they'll make quite a few of them well, we'll see though. Maybe, maybe not. Maybe I'm completely wrong. I'm terrible to judge at these things, and I don't know any insider info, so I'm just guessing. But anyway, that's it. What do you think of the 620 Steiger Case IH Anniversary? Eh, whatever. It's too long to say. <laughs> what do you think of this pretty darn good tractor for 20 bucks? If I'm not kidding, I think it's amazing. Love the paint scheme. I would probably not be able to pull this off that well myself i'm not real good at doing crisp lines on hood seams like that so plus the decal you know before i get out of here let's show you that decal a little closer this is a pretty nice looking decal i think it's got some fade to it uh got the case ih and the steiger logo in there the 60th all that good stuff so anyway as always thanks for watching guys hope you enjoyed it please like share comment it just kind of gives me motivation to keep going. <laughs> All right. Have a great night, everybody.